Yeah, so since we actually started GasReady two and a half years ago, our goal was to build the leading globally, the globally leading short-term rental management company. And uh, with these two deals, uh, that brings us a step closer. Currently, we already expanded into 10 cities uh, in six different countries. And we did that mo mostly organically. But last year, we had the chance to acquire a smaller competitor in London and Paris called Easy Rental Services. And that showed us the potential that we can actually accelerate the growth with acquisitions. And therefore, with this acquisition now in Porto, we will become the leading port, uh, player in northern Portugal and will also cement our position as one of the leading players in France. And uh, yeah, one of the problems that these smaller players face is that they don't have any in-house technology and that's uh, often limiting them to scale further than where they are. So when they're probably at about 50 properties or so, 50 to maybe maximum 100, it's getting really difficult for them to continue to grow and to run a profitable business. So that's why they're often looking for what's the next step and uh, reaching out to bigger players like us um, for acquisitions. So I would say the key for us to consolidate the market is lies in exactly that management system that we're building in-house. So for us, it was clear since day one that we need to have a very strong in-house technology to be able to scale the system uh, to hundreds and thousands of properties that we want to, ma want to manage across different cities. And we invested a lot into building this system in-house. By now, it's one of the most comprehensive systems uh, that is, can manage anything from uh, managing the properties across different channels, doing the price management, and then also coordinating the offline operations such as the uh, key handovers, the cleaning, the linen service, maintenance, all those aspects. And with bringing the portfolios of those smaller players onto the platform, we can help them to scale and we can build them something global that uh, is not really possible if you don't have in-house technology. Yeah, I think so far uh, we've done a really great job in scaling the business. We were probably one of the last players to enter this market of short-term rentals two and a half years ago. But since then we have had a really good traction and have been able to, to scale to one of the leading players. And we continue just to see a massive demand from smaller uh, hosts or property owners and then also from bigger B2B players uh, like uh, property developers and property investment firms that uh, want to want us to manage their portfolio. So by capturing those opportunities, we can um, scale further and cement our position as one of the leading players. Yeah, I can't talk too much about specific acquisitions that we're planning to do, but I can definitely say that we're speaking to several players at the moment. Um, it's going into the same direction that uh, this market is highly fragmented. Lots of players have sprung up, kind of uh, organically have built a portfolio of between anywhere between 20 to 100 properties, find it difficult now to scale further, find it difficult to um, build something really profitable because they don't have a technology that helps them to build something really efficient. So we see a lot of opportunities in this space and uh, players that reach out to us and I think there will be very uh, more interesting news coming from Guest Ready soon. Yeah, I would say one, uh, one challenge that we have is that we're somewhere uh, a technology company on the one side and then also a real estate and hospitality company on the other side and the technology side of the business is very scalable and we've built a really strong system there for uh, to scale globally but the hospitality and the real estate side of things um, that takes uh, much more time to scale and it's something that we need to do locally market by market city by city and build relationships there and have a really strong team in place locally to build something sustainable. So uh, we'll focus uh, again there on building the best team, building the best uh, setup locally to be able to deliver the best service to our customers. Yeah.
Well, in general, I feel that, as I said before, this space is highly fragmented and uh, on the demand side, actually, it's very consolidated. There are only a very few channels like Airbnb, Booking.com, HomeAway that capture most of this short-term rental market. On the demand, on the guest side, it's consolidated, but on the supply side, the host side, it's very much fragmented. So I think the the main trend that we're going to see over the next couple of years is actually going to be consolidation of this space. And uh, I think that's uh, something that will be the, the main trend uh, for, the, for the industry going forward.